This looks like the place. Goddamn perverts. Sorry, some shit like this. Hello? Mr. Tanterton? You there? Hmm. Well, I guess there are some perks to it. Mr. Tanterton, come out to play. If it's fun you want, Mr. Tanterton, it's fun you'll get. What the shit in hell is going on? Uh, I get it. You like a bit of role play. Well, let me tell you, Mr. Tanterton. I work hard. And... I play... hard. Mr. Tanterton, I see you've been tied up at the office all day. It must be hard for a man to be so tied to his job. What's the matter, Mr. Tanterton? Feeling a little Tongue tied? Don't 
don't worry. I can leave my hat on. What's your problem, mate? I'm giving you my best friggin' stuff here. What's your game, you bloody knobhead? There's a fucking killer in a panda mask behind you! I'm not in the mood for typons, dear. No. Just, just wait. I, I don't know who you are, but I, I, I have money. I, I can pay what you want. I'm an important partner in a law firm. Well, I hear that law is a cutthroat business. Civil solicitors. We specialise in giving you, the customer, the highest quality services. From our friendly professional staff, we're here to help. To our top notch legal experts, we're here to help. And our world class client relations, we're here to help. Kilmore and Percival solicitors are here to make sure you get the quality service you deserve. So when you think about solicitors, just remember, we're here, we're here, we're to, here to help. help. So what do you think? Did all of that in one take? You, you can't tell. Face of the corporation, that's what they call me. Ah. Mm. CV's a bit sparse. What'd you say you did before this, anyway? I... I was an entertainer. What, like magic and shit? Well, you certainly got dancers' legs. Yeah, something like that. Relax. It's a compliment. So why do you want to do this job, anyway? Just looking for a change of pace. It's a tough job, office junior. Lots of work to get done. Chances are you'll be the last girl standing. Well, I'm certainly up for the challenge. That's what I like to hear. Does this mean I've got the job? Welcome to Kilmore and Percival Legs. Morning, Mr. Daniel. Where are you heading to this morning? Ah, moving up in the world, Mr. Daniel. That's what I like to hear. Oh, it's security state. Who's that? That's the new office junior. I'm not sure they like to be called that anymore, mate. It's 2016, Mr. Daniel. 
No one sure of anything. <laughs> Allow me. Yeah. Level three? Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Yeah. It says on your pass. I guess it does. First day? That obvious, huh? I'm six. Oh, by the way. Yeah. Shit. I was about to say it jolts on level two. Thanks for the heads up. Hi. Oh, I guess this is me. See you around six. Oh, watch out, Carol. Alright Danny boy, confident, charming, funny, all at once, you've got this. Hi, you must be Damien. I've just transferred up from level one. IT department. Stop! Name? D Daniel. Daniel. Okay, Daniel, Daniel. You know how to set up a completion, right? Y yeah, of course. Of course, sir. See that pile of shit in there? I need all that shit signed off and on my desk by 5.30. Yeah, but... 5.30. Okay, but it's my first day. I don't give a fuck! Walters, I, I'm the new girl. Oh yes, Mr. Hook said you'd be coming. I'm Carol. I think I'm meant to file these. Yes, you'll want to do those at the same time as the others. Others? They want me to file all of these. Yes, it is quite a lot, isn't it? The girl before you left a lot of it. Come to think of it, so did the girl before her, and the girl before her, and the girl before her. But why is that exactly? Well, they don't exactly make life easy for the young, attractive juniors around here. They? The boys upon six. Hi, Mr. Hawk. Shut your cake, old Carol, and get back to work. You, legs. Make some coffees and bring them up to the boardroom, would you? Well, I was just... I wasn't asking! What a fucking asshole! I know. He's so sexy. <sighs> Come in. You, uh, you wanted to see me, sir? Damien, my boy. Take a seat. Can I ask what this is about, sir? I'm afraid I have some rather dreadful news. Well, what is it, sir? One of my fellow senior partners, Phil Tanterton, was found dead last night. D dreadful, nasty business. Cut from ear to ear, they told me. That is... Awful news, sir. Bloody terrible mess. 
found with some young strumpet in his own home, no less. Do they know who did it, sir? Mm, not the foggiest. Reckon it could be a robbery gone wrong. Does anyone else know about this, sir? Oh, no. Just you so far. And the other partners. If this got leaked to the press, it would be pandemonium. Then why are you telling me, sir? Well, every cloud and all that poppycock, it means that we have an opening. F for senior partner? Well, that's the thing. Now, I thought it should be one of you boys from level six. Wait, but I thought I was a shoo <laughs> Now, my dear boy, fair's fair. Now, I thought I'd check the figures tomorrow morning and see who's earned the spot the most. With the greatest of respect, sir, I think we all know that's me. Oh, you've got nothing to worry about then, have you? Odd, though, the accounts tell me that your numbers have been down lately. That's bull... <coughs> That seems unlikely, sir. Numbers don't lie, Damien. If I were you, I'd make today count. And Damien? Yes, sir. Pass the message to the other boys, would you? Yes, sir, of course. What did the old man say, Damo? Nothing. Did he mention the promotions? No. Who ate all the bear claws? He didn't... He didn't say anything, all right? Hey. How do you fellas feel about having one of our little uh, gatherings tonight? A level six ranger! Yeah. Yeah. Come on! Let's do it! Oops! Ah. Of course! Yeah. Oh. Oh. You bet! Oh. Birds! Like any of this would work without them. Oh. 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 So it's settled then. Oh. I'll make the arrangements yeah. with security Steve. Oh. Uh, Mr. Hook, oh. I have the oh. coffees that you asked for. Well, oh. what are you waiting for? Bring them in. <laughs> hey! Who's this little princess then? Our new legal ass sister. Ariel. Oh, like the mermaid. Or the uh, washing powder? It's. Uh, it's spelt differently. I like to think of it as interesting. I don't think he picked you for your name, do you? <laughs> nah, Dick. I'm sure she has a. Over school. <laughs> well, go on. Give us a twirl. Well, go on, love. Show him the goods. So, drinks-wise, what are we thinking? Beer, yeah. lager, tequila.
Sorry, I didn't mean to scare you. <laughs> Don't worry about it. You could have been a six-foot teddy bear and I still would have jumped. I mean, yeah, sounds terrifying. How's your first day going? Kilmore and Percival, everything you hoped it would be? You know, I thought it would be a step up from my last job, but somehow it feels like they've hired off the sex offenders register. Thanks. Not you. I'm talking about the wolf on Wall Street and his merry men in there. How the hell did those guys get to where they are? It's like they still think it's the 80s. Classic bullies. Get the nerds to do all the work while they live it up, being big shots. <laughs> so wait, does that make us the nerds? <laughs> I'd better get back. Try not to let them get you down. Us nerds, we're in this together. Good night. Good night. Night. Good night, Veronica. That's everyone. You guys are good to go. Are you sorted to go? Sure thing, boss man. Ah, easy money. And safe. Jesus. Not quite, Daniel, Daniel. What's that? The, the files you asked me to complete earlier. Gonna stick them in your office on my way out. Out? Oh, Daniel, Daniel, the party's just about to start. I've got to get home. Home? Oh, what for? A TV dinner and a cry wank? I'd love to, but... Come on, Daniel, Daniel. You want to fit in up here, right? I can stay for one. Ah, <laughs> oh, Daniel, Daniel. Up here, we work hard and we play hard. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Meet the Playboys at level six. <laughs> <laughs> Ah! Oh. Ah! <laughs> Thanks. So, how are you enjoying your first day on level six, Danny boy? Yes, great. Not used to the fast lane, ah? I guess you'd go a bit easy on my first day. You did! You did! <laughs> Made with real dick! <laughs> Strong cheese, please. Just the way your sister loves it! <laughs> Boys! Boys! The girls! Good work, Garcon. Send them up! In a ah. loose oh. set. Oh. Ah. 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 Ah.
strippers. Oh, oh. Not just strippers, Daniel Daniel. The finest strippers money can buy. Here. You sure this is the right place? Yeah, I've done a couple of solo jobs here before. Real assholes come of the earth types, but the money's good. Oh, someone's coming. Lazy asshole. Good evening, ladies. About damn time. Do you know how cold it is out there? Nice to see you too, Jasmine. You coming? Sure. Wow. Let me guess. Level four account guys again? Nope. Level five? Level six? Holy shit, the high flyers. What's level six? Level six is like the top dogs around here. The fee earners. The ones that make the big bucks. One night on level six played right, it set you up for a whole month. Longer. How's that work? These guys will pay double, even triple the going rate for a dance. Start throwing in some extras, and you're looking at some serious bank. Wait, no one mentioned extras. You said this was a nice, easy, laid-back gig. Yeah, all you've got to do is lay back. <laughs> you guys don't do that, do you? Depends on the men. And the money. Come on, let's go bankrupt these cocksuckers. Watch out for the jolt on two. Did you see Games of Thrones last night? Sky plastic. it. Are you ready? What the hell is that? What? You said come as a sexy cowgirl. We meant the Wild West. Well, they had cows, didn't they? For fuck's sake. Hey, hey, lads! Someone's coming. And here.
So boys, are you ready for some ludicrously expensive fun? Okay, almost done. What the hell? Finishing off some work. No, I mean, why are you jumping around like that? Oh, it's the lights. They're on timers. They've got motion sensors, but sometimes you have to give it a bit of welly. I see. Have they still got you working here at this late hour on your first day? Yeah. Well, I just have to run these upstairs, then I'm free to go. <laughs> so, uh, what are they doing up there? Uh, one of their private parties. They have them sometimes. They can get a little wild. Sometimes I like to watch them on the security cameras. Okay, that got weird quickly. I'm just gonna run these up there, okay? Oh, tell Damien I'm down here all alone if he needs anything. Yeah. Sure thing. See how this party's getting on. A little tame, boys. I'd expect better. Level six. Okay, wild boys. That's everyone. Just gonna take a quick sweep of the floors. Gee, thanks, Mr. Exposition. Just make sure no one disturbs us, yeah? You're the boss. Not yet. <laughs> Thank you. 
April Fool, motherfucker. Pshu, pshu, pshu. <laughs> Hey man, sorry. I thought everyone was out. Hey man, what the hell are you wearing? Hey buddy, I'm talking to you. Hey, I said... Oh, I'm sorry. Hey, buddy, what the... Sometimes I just lose control. The things you have to do to get your foot in the door. Oh good, the show's just starting. Oh you are naughty boys. I bet you're gonna show them what for. Now, where is my sexy man? Oh, Mr. Damien, where are you? Oh, Carol, you silly bitch. Don't let them find you in here. They'll string you up if they... <gasps> Goddamn motherfucking piece of shit in a crapping basket! Damien, is that you? Oh, I knew. I knew there was something between us and I knew you felt it too. I like the mask. It's very s and &M. I like to be strangled myself. Duly noted. <laughs>
And you quit if I can do you in the bathroom. Ew, no. Oh, prude. All right, sweet cheeks. Two hundred quid if I can do you in the bathroom. Maybe later, sweetheart. Stage names only. Right, fuck yeah. Well, what do you want? Um, we don't actually have to fuck these guys, do we? Who wouldn't want to fuck these charmers? <laughs> Look, the beauty of this job is we can get as much or as little as we want to out of it. It's your body to do what you want with. Just don't let anybody try and make you do anything you don't want to do. And if they do, they'll have me to work with you. One of the girls now, Cindy. You good? Oh, remember. Try and have some fun. Told you, lads, still a bird, yeah! <laughs> what about you, handsome? Fancy a dance one on one? I promise, I can be quite a handful. Not for me, love. Did I hear you could be a, quite a handful? You did. <laughs> <laughs> Daniel, Daniel, what's going on? We got some prize cows here. <laughs> Literally. And you're just standing around looking at your trotters. It's just not the kind of thing I'm used to. <laughs> you're playing with the big boys now, Daniel, Daniel. You need to learn to loosen up. None of these girls doing it for you. All done, Mr. Hook, all... Oh, we're just having a party here, Legs. You should join us. I told you, my name is... Ariel? Oh, fuck. What the fuck are you doing here? I... Hang about! How do you know Legs here? We used to work together. Well, now I work here. As what? As an ass. Hang on a minute. Uh, you mean she used to work with you doing this? Yeah. Oh, hi, Ariel. Oh, my God. This is too amazing. Which one were you? What? The uh, village girls here. Which one were you? The biker. The biker. The biker. I just don't believe it. I'll tell you what, why don't you show me and the lads here some of your moves? You seriously left us for this? Now, now. Better to be an office hall than a paid one. Ariel, wait. Bye, Ariel. Look, Pocahontas, it's your last chance, yeah? 400 quid for a quickie in the bathroom. <laughs> come on, come on, come on. What the hell is wrong with this thing? Ariel, are you okay? What was that? A reminder. A reminder that I shouldn't have even tried. Is it true? Or that I used to be a stripper? Do you know why I took this job? I never gave a shit about what anyone thought about me. Or what I did for a living. Not for a second. No, I didn't give a shit when the mums at school found out what I did for a job. No, I didn't give a shit when they stopped talking to me at the school gates. I didn't even give a shit when they started keying my car and dropping shit through my letterbox. I did, however, give a huge shit when my little girl came home from school crying because the other kids called her mum a whore. I never cared about what anyone thought about me until I saw my little girl ashamed of me for the first time. I thought that getting a respectable job would change things, but I can see that same goddamn look on your face right now. No, it doesn't bother me. Bother you? Well, it doesn't get to bother you. What the hell is wrong with this fucking thing? Do you know what, Daniel? Fuck you. 
Fuck them and fuck this place. So much for we were in this together, huh? wanted was a normal life. That's all I fucking... Hello? Security... Stu? No. Scott? Oh, Steve! You lost. Oh, oh, fuck. Calm down, legs. Oh, it's Carol. She's annoying as fuck. I know. No, she's she's dead, and so is security. Simon, it, that's not right. Come on, love. Enough with the wind up. There, there is a guy in a panda mask, and he is killing people. You must take me for a right mug. I'm telling you the the, the truth. If you just wanted to get me alone. You only had to ask. What? No, I'm telling you that there is a guy in a panda mask and he is killing people. Look, this was bound to happen sooner or later. What is? You and me. So it can be a drunken thing, an office party at Christmas, or we can get it over and done with now. <laughs> there is not enough vodka in this world. I find that hard to believe given your last job. I was a stripper, not a whore. Is there a difference? You're a fucking pig. Look, I know your type, Legs. And you all have a price. So how about we call yours your job? Now let's see how far up these legs go, yeah? <gasps> I'm going to lose the apartment, I'm going to lose the job, I'm not going to get the car, the dental plan, or... Daniel, oh, there is a serial killer loose in the building! Sorry, what? It's a serial killer loose in the building. He killed Steve. No, not Steve. And Carol. Yeah. Right, now give me a phone. Give me a phone. It won't work. The roof's are lead-lined. We need to get out of here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's wrong? We need to get the others. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. 
just just checking out the goods. Yeah, well, eyes are for looking, Buster. I've got money. And I've got boundaries. Hmm. Well, what about you? No way, dude. We're not prostitutes, we're dancers. And not for that kind of money, anyway. Huh. Okay. You take cards? And where am I going to swipe that? My ass. Okay, okay. Uh, just, just give me like 30 seconds. I doubt you'd last half that, hun. <laughs> oh, you weren't gonna fuck him, were you? Oh, probably not. But it's fun to watch him sweat. <laughs> anyway, it's 2016. Of course we take card. Where were you keeping that? <laughs> Are you enjoying yourself? I? <laughs> Although, I should be for 200 quid. Hey, dude! You haven't got, like, a few bucks I can borrow, do you? In a minute, mate. Can't you see I'm busy? Oh man, these drugs are kicking in! There's a mahoosive looking panda in a suit over there. It's okay mate, this coat's cut with all kinds of shit. I'm preparing to see the flying baby Jesus. Oh man, he's got a scary knife. <laughs> Fuck! Watch the teeth, love, you're supposed to be a profession. Who the fuck is this prick? Sorry. Don't mean to cut things short. Fuck! <laughs> fuck! <laughs> fuck! He... He's got blood all over my suit! This thing cost me 2,000 quid! You fucking prick! He loves that suit! I do! It's my favourite suit! Well... You're gonna have to pay for that. Yeah. Looks like we're gonna take you to the cleaners. Uh, buddy? Your, uh, your dick's out. Oh, fuck. Cheers, mate. No worries, man. Right. Where were we? Oh, don't worry. I'm not even real. Or am I? So basically, you just add a little bit of lemon juice, you rub it around the edge, and then the shower head cleans itself whilst you use it. Huh. Cost the price of a citrus fruit. But these big companies want you to spend all that money on their cleaning products, which is rubbish because... you to panic, but there might be a mad head with a panda mask with a knife often people. Might be? Well, could be these drugs. Ah! It's definitely not the drugs then. Is this like a normal stripper thing or? Like one in ten? When I say go for the lift. Oh, don't leave now, officer. I've been a really bad boy. Go! It 
needs a card key. Aren't you dreamy? Can I get your digits? Aren't you happy to be meeting a genuine car-carrying psychopath? Cindy, we need to run. Aren't you beautiful? Don't let it go to your head. Don't worry. You're next. I'll call the lift. You go get the others. On. I think we might be too late. What's wrong? The keycard isn't working. So we're stuck? We're stuck. Ah! Oh my god! You're Ariel! We've got to get out of here! There's a psycho killer! Casca say. Uh, 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 run, run away! Uh, uh, oh, come on. You're just uh, milking it now. Get yourself something nice. I can see why they call you Dick. We're here to help. What happened to the lights? Ariel, what the fuck are you guys doing? Why are you guys hiding down there? Who the fuck is this idiot? We need to go! What? Why? Oi! Oi! It's got me Vodka! You cut me 
dick off. I'm dickless. Bad panda. I hope you're really proud of yourself. I'm gonna go away and die now. What is this place? The executive boardroom. It's like the worst place we could be. No exits and the only thing keeping that nutter out there is a fucking keycard. Who the hell was that guy? Some kind of psycho. I gathered that Einstein. I mean, what did he want? Jesus, Jasmine, I don't know. Maybe he wanted to treat you to a KFC in a night in a travel lodge. What the fuck do you think he wants? He's not here to... Get down! Did he see? I don't think so. But it won't be long till he finds us. And he's got the only card that works. So what? We're just going to wait here for him to come and get us? You got a better idea? Yes. I say, we go and rush him. Are you a complete idiot? This guy is a professional killer, not a dairyly triangle. He killed half the people in this office without any of us even noticing. Who the hell are you calling an idiot? I'm not the one walking around up here like a pretty woman. Do you have any idea what you look like? What, because I try to do something with my life rather than spend every day being treated like a slut? And they really treat you any differently up here? Was it really worth abandoning all of your friends for? You know what your problem is? You've always refused to embrace who you really are. Well, either way, we'd still be stuck here waiting to die. Maybe not. What do you mean? Storeroom, secure, locks only from the inside. Standard locks, not on the system. And there's a fire escape at the back. But to get through the exits, we need a security pass. True, but when the building systems come on in the morning, the fire escapes will be operational as normal. They open at six for the cleaners. About two hours. OK, but you forgot one thing. We need a key card to get round the back in the first place. Yeah. How are we going to get in there without one of those guards? Vent system. It's small, but if we can get through, we can unlock the door from the other side. How are we supposed to get through there? Well, maybe not me, but... I seriously doubt it. These beauties are never going to fit through there. What? No way. I have enough trouble with lifts, let alone crawling into that death trap. Or we can all just wait here to get murdered. It's the best choice. It'll be easy, I promise. Just a few feet, let the rest of us through, and we'll wait there till morning. There is no way in hell that I... Come on, the door's open. Really should have run it.
let her go. Oh, I don't think so. I've just completed the full set. Errol, you don't understand it. Why are you doing this? Why does anyone do anything when they go to the office? Because they're paid to. Paid? By who? <laughs> Damien, what the hell I is- I told you Legs here wasn't that bright. It's a shame, really. I was looking forward to having a bit of uh, thigh candy at work every day. What the hell is going on here? Well, it came to my attention that I was going to be passed over for my well-deserved promotion this morning. And I'd gone to such an effort to open up a position on the partner's circle. Of course, I didn't realise it was a numbers game, so I had to get creative. So I called our friend here to eliminate the competition. Wait, so you set this up for a fucking promotion? Maybe you're brighter than I thought. Why the hell did you hire us? Well, our friend here has a little condition for his services. I guess his kink is... What do you birds like to be called nowadays? Exotic dancers? Or is that two nineties? Ah, uh, he'll like to mix business with pleasure. The deal was, he takes out my competitors, and I provide the entertainment. So what? All of us were just collateral damage? Business is war. And war has its casualties. Oh my god. You're the actual psychopath here. All right. Enough flapping your gums. You can kill the bitch now. <laughs> We've met loads of assholes like you down at the club, haven't we, Ariel? What are you on about? Guys, we've plenty of money to make up for their lack of other things. You know what else we learnt? A swift kick in the nuts hurts like hell. <laughs> Classic stripper move. We still got it. You fucking slat! I'll gut you myself. You just can't get the stuff these days. We should run. Yeah. Nice try, you piece of shit. But this place opens in an hour. It's going to be flooded with people, and this is your only way out. Now, wait just one minute. There's just one more thing we need to take care of. You leave now, and your little boyfriend dies. You bastard! Let him go! Stand there. The bird will be open soon. Uh, we'll see if Romeo here lasts that long. The master key opens the fire escapes. Just go. Your choice, Ariel. I'm so sorry. Ah, true I 
just have to wait until morning. And then I'm home free. He's right, you know. Overtime could be such a... Killer. I don't know about you. <laughs> it's the arseholes that get me. trying to cut and run. Well now it's my turn to cut and run. <laughs> okay. We get the point. Fuck you, Chi Chi.
Going down. something you should know. And what's that? The lift jolts on two. <laughs> Don't worry. First day's always tough. <sighs> oh my God, what happened to you? Turns out, this office has a panda problem. What do you mean? There's nothing there? Mother! Is this? <gasps> Motherfucker! Spoon cost me two thousand quid.
business with pleasure. <laughs> 